I'm Kiri Eliana. So in today's video, I have a Christmas haul for you guys. So Merry Christmas or belated Merry Christmas because this is not gonna come out today. But it is Christmas. I just got back from the movies and all the good stuff, opening presents, whatever. So I thought I would give you guys a haul. Last time on my Christmas vlog, I actually did Vlogmas and that was literally stressing me out. But I included the haul in my Christmas vlog, but I thought that this time I would make a separate video. I also have a haul on TikTok if you guys go wanna check that out. It's only 10 minutes, so yeah. But let's go ahead and jump into it. Okay, starting with the first things, we're just gonna do like candy. And my candy did not come in this bag. I just put it in this bag because it was convenient. But I got sour candy canes. I love sour candy canes so much. And then I just got a bunch of chocolate, so Kitch Kat, Snickers, Hershey's, whatever, whatever. And then I got a 35 pack of extra gum. I literally love the watermelon gum for this gum. I don't, there's, there's no need to explain. Then I got some Hershey Kiss with almonds. Then last but not least, my favorite candy, Airhead Extreme. These are just the strips. So that is everything food wise. Now for my stocking stuffers that do not have to do with food. My mom got me this castor oil set. So we have this castor oil and then we have this castor oil which is used for your eyebrows and your eyelashes. But this is just an entire set. I guess that this is like purely just the oil. Hold on, I, even, I have not opened not one thing. So yeah, this is purely just the oil. It's really thick oil. And it's good for like lashes growth and eyebrow growth. I believe this is the spoolie for this. And then this is just castor oil already in the container with the little spoolie for the eyelashes and then this for the eyebrows or whatever. But I'm not gonna put on my eyebrows because my eyebrows are already thick enough and I, I don't need no more. But my mom, she also got me some jewelry from this brand Pavoli and then this brand Kisyon. I don't know, but we're gonna open them up and I'm gonna show you guys the jewelry because I absolutely love it. Now, if you don't know me, I love gold jewelry more than anything. And so I ordered gold jewelry off of Sheen, but it tarnishes and stuff like that. So my mom got me all 14 karat gold. So it doesn't tarnish, but she got me these hoop earrings, which have a K in the middle and they're so cute. And I love bamboo type earrings and they won't get like brown like my other bamboo earrings have. She also got me this heart neck. Okay. She also got me this heart necklace, which I absolutely adore because of the fact that I have one, but it's from Sheen. And so if I constantly wear it, it's, it's not gonna be the same color. And my mom has these earrings, but she has her initials on them. Now from the brand Kisyon, or Kisyon, I don't know, I haven't opened it yet. It's this necklace with a K initial on it. I haven't opened it yet. When I saw this in my stocking, I thought that it was an X at first. And if you don't know, my boyfriend's name is Xavier. So I was like, why would she give me an initial with an X on it? I mean, it's cute, but why? And so let me see which one is the right way. Okay, so the back of it actually has a heart on it and then the front has the K initial and it's so smooth and it's gold and I absolutely love it. And she has this necklace too, but hers has an A on it. Then another thing in my stocking stuffer, I got a 20 pack of fudgy film Insta, like, Polaroid film because two Christmases ago, my dad got me the Hello Kitty Polaroid camera, but I thought I broke it. So I took all the film out and then I realized that I didn't break it. The film was just jammed. And so I was like, I wasted all that film for nothing. So I haven't been able to use it since February of eighth grade. And so I actually got some more film so I can finally use it. And I was gonna use it tonight because I was with my boyfriend, you know, take a matching Polaroid picture. Definitely gonna save the film for when it's needed because I did just use the film just to use it last time I had film. She got me this little like emergency kit bag, but I already have an emergency kit bag, so I'm probably just gonna use it for like touch up makeup or something like that when I need it. Then the last thing she got me in my stocking was the EOS Holiday Limited Edition like balm set with strawberry cheer and then pink champagne. And I saw this on Pinterest and Instagram. And when I saw it in Walmart, I was like, I want that. But she was like, I'm not paying $10 for it. But she got it anyway, she got it anyway. And I was so surprised when I saw this. I haven't even opened it yet, but after this video, I'm definitely gonna like open everything. These are just two simple items, so I'm just gonna include it. My aunt got me a $65 Ulta gift card, which I loved, I asked for this. I think I actually asked for 50, so she gave me 15 extra dollars, A. And then my Nana, she gave me like, oh, look at this little cute packaging. But inside of here is $20, your girl is balling. I love this little cute packaging. It literally, the $20 goes back in here. 
And I just think that is so cute and I'm so grateful. So we're gonna hop into the stuff that my boyfriend got me. Okay, so starting off with like my favorite thing ever. He got me these super cute Hello Kitty slippers, y'all. Like, I don't even know where he found them or how much he paid for them. Not that it matters, but it's just like, these are so cute. Oh my, bro, he's so sweet. And I got him gifts, of course, too. Boop, boop, they're so cute. Oh my goodness, man. Then, I've been seeing this like all over TikTok and some on Pinterest. And I didn't think that, I just thought they were like limited edition. Like, you can't find it anywhere. It's the Teddy Bear Hello Kitty plushie. I don't know where he found this, or how much he paid for it. But y'all, this is, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Like, if you guys don't know, I love Hello Kitty. Mm. Eighth grade was definitely a hardcore phase. Now I still love it, but I'm not as hardcore. But Hello Kitty is always in my heart. And anything Hello Kitty, I'm just gonna love. He's starting to bring my obsession back, man. I don't know if I'm gonna have to back it up, but I love this. So cute, look at the little blush on it. He got me this like bear rose thingy and it smells like a real rose, so I think it actually is real, but it looks like this. It's so cute, y'all. But in the drawer, it came with a necklace, but I'm wearing the necklace now. We're just gonna come close. But this is the necklace, you guys. It is so beautiful. I literally wear it 24 seven. I've been wearing it since he put it on me and I went over his house on the 23rd to exchange gifts. So it's the 25th, I've been wearing it for two days straight. Okay, this was actually his, but he said it shrunk and it couldn't fit him anymore. So I was like, you know what, just give it to me. And so, yay! It's just the Sanrio Little Twin Stars hoodie. There's nothing on the back, but it's just right here, and it smells like him, so. Now, speaking of clothing, since we're already on that, let's go ahead and get into the clothing that I got. Now, for Christmas, I rarely ask for clothing, or I just ask for money to get clothes, because I'm really picky when it comes to my clothes. I like to pick out the stuff that I want so I don't seem ungrateful, or so I don't waste someone's money, but they bought me clothes anyway, so, yeah. So my stepdad, he got me this jacket. Now, I actually like the jacket. I feel like I could pull this off with some jeans and a tube top, but this is the type of jacket that you cannot wear every day or like one time a week and then another time. This is like a jacket that you can only wear like max three times a year because it's so like bold and out there. But I could probably wear it for spirit week when we do like jock or throwback Thursday or something like that, jock versus nerd. But it's actually really cute and I feel like I could pull this off. Then my mom, she got me this little sweatshirt from Champion. All the clothes that I got were from Champion because I had a sale, so they took advantage of it. But she didn't give me the sweatpants to it. Why? Yo no sé. Honestly, yo no sé. So I'm gonna have to pair these with jeans or something because I don't have the sweatpants. And now I'm gonna look like my little sister. But this is gonna be a little combo fit, combo fit. Then, now this is my favorite piece of clothing. She got me just the classic gray champion sweat set and then they have the sweatpants with it. I absolutely love these and they're so soft. Oh my goodness, like I think I can show you guys the inside. Like you can tell by that inside material. Oh, OMG, OMG y'all, like magnificent. Then she got me this Hello Kitty beanie. And we were, me and my mom, my sister, we were looking for them on the shelves on Walmart. And the only Hello Kitty beanies that they had were like all rainbow. And we were trying to look for this one because they showed that they had it. I don't know how they found it, but it magically appeared. And I'm gonna take this off and keep it. I'm probably gonna put it on my mirror somewhere just because it's really cute. But I got this beanie. I love it. Oh, I love it. Then I got this pink cheetah print blanket. So my room is getting done. So this is gonna be like a throw blanket that I just throw on my bed or whatever, whatever. And then speaking of my room, I also got some ivy leaves with fairy lights. But the thing is, I don't know where I'm gonna put the ivy leaf or fairy lights yet. I have to have my grandmother help me out with that because she's helping me get my room together. But yeah, my favorite color is pink and my favorite print is cheetah print. And it's so soft. I'll cover it with it, of course, but it's mainly just for decoration purposes because it's also like pretty small, it's not that big. And then my little ivy and fairy lights. So we got some stuff for my room, it's a start. Anyone wanna finish buying it? No? Okay. Okay, so moving on to one of my favorite parts yet. If you don't know me, my favorite scent from Back to Body Works, all time, forever, will never fade away, strawberry pound cake. Previously, my mom had got me a strawberry pound cake room spray. I'm actually gonna go get that. 
She got me the Strawberry Pound Cake Room Spray and I barely use it yet, or I haven't used it yet. Like I've used it like maybe three times max, two. Actually she used it, then I used it. So like two times, it's full to the brim, right? But to add on to that, guys, I have my Strawberry Pound Cake candle. Why? I have like three candles I haven't even touched yet. Then, if you guys don't know, I recently just ran out of my strawberry pancake perfume. This is how the packaging used to come. It used to look like this. You hear this? Hold on. What, you, you see? Do you see the liquid? Yeah, I, I don't really see it either. It's like up to like right here. So I basically ran out of it and it's my favorite scent ever. So I've been really cautious with it, but I guess I got a refill. Guess who got a refill? You thought I was finished? Mm -mm. Then, I also got the body cream to as well. And then last but not least, I got the shower gel. So I literally got like a full house strawberry pound cake, man. I don't know. Let's like see if we can set this up for a thumbnail picture maybe. I only ever had the perfume. So for me to have these other two things, it's like such a blessing. I'm so grateful. And I ran out, so that can go in the trash. Then, I don't even know why I asked for this. I was literally setting myself up, but it's this heatable waxing kit. So I'm gonna open it. It comes with a after wax treatment spray. So after you're done waxing. Then it comes with, I think this is like the charger to heat up the wax. Well, and then of course it comes with the wax strips because what are you gonna wax with? Then it comes with a refillable wax attachment. And last but not least, it comes, what the heck? Last but not least, it comes with the actual waxer. And I think this is the part that you plug it in to heat it up. What the heck? But yeah, this is how it is. And you just like roll it on and then put that thing on and let it rip. The first time I try this, guys, I will definitely record a video because I feel like my reaction is gonna be. I have a high pain tolerance because I can tolerate pain better. So yeah, this is just the waxing thingy, but I'm really, really, really excited to try it. And I did not expect to get this. Like a lot of the stuff on here, I did not expect to get like, or I forgot that I even added it onto my wish list. That's literally it with the stuff over here. Like I have like, all right. I like two sections. And so that stuff with the stuff over here. So we're gonna move over a little bit. So I don't know that's where, where do I start? We're gonna sound like beauty, I guess. So my mom, she got me this wash bag and, oh, I forgot to mention, my grandmother, she gave me the ivy and the fairy lights along with the blanket, the cheetah print blanket, forgot to mention. But my mom, she got me this wash bag for like hygiene products, shower products, which is really good for traveling or for me i keep all my hygiene products and shower products in a basket and i bring the basket with me to the bathroom and i don't keep my stuff in the bathroom because my sister likes to steal my stuff so i keep it in my room where i know that's going to be safe and she said she got me this mainly because she knows that i keep my stuff in a basket and this will just be more aesthetic and more pleasing and it's just so cute and simple like damn this is really cute and simple i i like it this i like it this a lot so in this box right here, there are actually eyelash curler replacements because I curl my lashes and it's always good to have the replacements with you so you're not using an old eyelash rubber piece because it can actually pull out your eyelashes. So I think this is either a 50 pack or an 100 pack. Oh, it's an 80 piece pack. So yeah, I just got some eyelash curler replacements because I needed them. And my grandmother gave me those. And then my grandmother, she also gave me a two pack of e.l.f. eyeliner because I want to start doing eyeliner on my eyes again. But it's going to take some practice because I haven't done it in a while. And the way that I used to do it is not the way that I want to do it now. And then she also got me some telescopic mascara because I finally figured out how to use telescopic correctly. And my lash is going to be mwah. So my mom, she got me the Kosar X. I think that's how you pronounce it. Kosar X Snail Mucin. I've been wanting this for the longest, but I didn't want to get the fake one. And she told me she got this off of Amazon. So it is the real one. And that skin is going to be glossy. I mean, it already is, but it kind of looks more oily than glossy. Guys, it's been a day. <laughs> it's been a day. This is like, it's like, what time is it? It's 11.58. It's almost 12 a.m. But yeah, I finally got my Snail Mucin. I'm really excited to try it out. 
The only thing I don't like about it is you have to go like that. And I'm so used to going like this with my products. Then my mom, she got me two of the Ordinary Caffeine Serums. I only expected to get one. I actually didn't even expect them to get all. I actually forgot that I added them on my wish list. But she got me them. And it's supposed to help with the puffiness around your eyes, discoloration in your face, and brighten your face. So this is really, really good. And I'm glad that I got two. And she got one as well. I also have the Ordinary Niacinamide Serum, and I like that. Reduces appearance of eye contour, pigmentation, and puffiness. Yeah. Now, we're saving these gifts for last. Because they're very special, you guys. Best gifts for last. So my grandmother, she got me this Lazy Susan for my vanity, because I really needed one to put my hygiene. Oh, guys, I thought my address was on here. It's up here, but that's fine. She got me this Lazy Susan for my vanity because I really, really, really needed one to put my hygiene products on or to put my makeup like that I always use on. But I'm also getting a new vanity, so yes, I'm very excited for that. Seven adjustable layers, large storage capacity, easy to assemble and disassemble, washable and eco-friendly material, strong enough to bear heavy products, keeps dresser tidy, easy access to cosmetics, water resistant, washable, environmental, and safety. Period. So I'm really excited that I finally got one of these because I see these on Pinterest too and it just looks so organized and cute. So I was like, I need one. So my grandmother, she also got me the pink fresh and clean body mist along with the Victoria's Secret Bare Vanilla Body Mist. And I've been wanting these for a minute. And the reason why is because I really want to see if this smells fresh and clean. And I really wanted this just because I love vanilla scents and I actually used it and it smells so good. It smells perfect. I literally love it. I honestly love these too. I cannot wait to try them out. And then I have the EOS Vanilla Cashmere Body Lotion. I've also been wanting this for a while, but people say it smells too sweet, but we're going to smell it right now. We're going to get my honest reaction because I haven't smelled it yet. It smells perfect. What are you talking about? And my boyfriend loves the vanilla scent on me, so what can I say? What can I say? But I am really excited to actually have this now in my hands because I would just see it on Pinterest and now I have it in my hands. <laughs> my grandmother also got me this, by the way. My mom, she got me the Coco Colada Tree Hut Shea Butter Scrub and then their Foaming Gel Wash. This is a little set. Really cute and it smells really tropical, but it also brings back memories. What does it smell like? It smells like coconut method body. That's what it smells like. But yeah, I just got these and cannot wait to use them. The only thing that I am scared of is because my um, body scrubs, when after I'm done shaving or whatever, they start to burn. Be scared. Now it's time for the bad boys. Like the big, big bad boys, bro. So we're gonna start off with like the smallest bad boy or whatever. I got the Marc Jacobs tote bag. My mom told me she was gonna get me one for Christmas. Then she got me another gift, which is over here. And I was like, there's no way she's gonna get me that and a Marc Jacobs tote bag. And I kind of thought she was just joking or that she would just said that and just wasn't gonna get it anymore. But I've been using a black tote bag for the longest and she actually got me the Marc Jacobs tote bag this time. I need to fix it, guys. She got me the Marc Jacobs tote bag. Boom, y'all. Then, last two things, my mom. She got me the iPhone 15 Plus in pink. I'm actually recording with it now, but this is just a phone, period, really cute. And I also have a Hello Kitty case that came with it. I'm just gonna post it on the screen because it's on my phone right now. This is the case, you guys, and the phone is just pink, but yeah. I didn't feel like putting it in a picture. And then my dad, oh my dad. My dad, my dad, my dad. You wanna know what he got me? The pink iPad. Ah, the pink iPad, y'all. Like, oh my goodness. I mwah, I was not expecting to get this at all. I literally just added it on my wish list just to add it on my wish list. Like, this, the waxing kit, added it on my wish list just to add it to my wish list. The phone, added it on my wish list just to add it to my wish list. The tote bag, added it on my wish list just to add it to my wish list. And I actually ended up getting stuff. So I'm like, that's literally how I am. But I am so grateful for this. I've already set it up because it was like early. So I already like set up the iPad. Like everything was like, wait, is it gonna work? Everything's like already set up or whatever. So I've been using it. I got it 
pretty sure I yeah I got it on the 22nd so it was an early Christmas gift and then I also got my phone early as well so that's really it and I'm so grateful and so thankful for everything that I got but I'm just gonna put the pictures on the screen of three additional gifts but this is a privacy screen protector for my iPad a pink keyboard for my iPad and then a pink case for my iPad okay guys so I'm back with Nisia and this is the pink keyboard that I had got that she's trying to type on right here and it's, the, it's the classy type or whatever and then this is the case that I got for it it's just a regular flip case I didn't want a keyboard or anything to it and it has like a spot for an apple pencil and then I didn't get the screen protector yet it's still on the way but yeah that my dad also bought me but it's really for my grandmother so my grandmother got me that my grandmother on my dad's side and then the grandmother that i was talking about who got me like all this stuff is the grandmother on my stepdad's side so yeah i'm really 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 super duper grateful and blessed and very thankful and i thank god for everything that i have right now because it would not have been done without him giving everybody the financial resources to do all of this good jazz but I hope you guys enjoyed your Christmas. I hope you got everything that you wanted and you deserve. I hope that you had some good time with your family and ate some good food. And I hope that you had some fun activities. Remember that I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. And I hope you guys enjoyed this little haul. And if you want, send me your hauls on my Instagram. Because I will definitely look at them. Like, mwah, I love watching hauls. So yeah, I love you guys so much. Remember that you are loved. I love you. God bless. Mwah. Bye, guys.